What's up everyone, Ray J7000 here, today I've got a Grand War TDM on the map Fallen using the Scarl suppressed with that gold camo and I'm rushing for that first blood and what the hell, what, what is this? Did he noob tube me or something? Oh no, a flash grenade, yeah obviously that's going to kill me. Um, anyway, today I wanted to talk to you guys about getting high kill streaks and easy ways to do that, you know, it's like your Osprey Gunners, Juggernauts and whatever. And if you're going to go for these, you really want the majority of your kills to come from your other streaks that you get. And look at this guy, this guy. Wait, I see, I've got my x-ray vision on. I see, you can't hide from me. And you're dead. Sit down, son. And come on, I've got a real knife the hell. That's commando in this game for you. Knife to the head, that's nasty. Um, yeah, anyway, today, uh high kill streaks and like I really recommend you run the reaper because that is going to get you pretty much every kill streak in the game like you see in this game I get my reaper and like this is quite a hard map to use it on I would say just because there's buildings everywhere it's quite hard to like maneuver the missile around it um but anyway uh yeah so the really want to use the reaper and I managed to get one kill off getting my osprey with it but it's right because I do manage to pick it up and turn around the corner and kill some guy. Um, so yeah, I really recommend you use the Reaper. And if you're playing something like TDM or Kill Confirmed, you're going to need to use your uh, Predator missiles as one of your kill streaks. That's going to help you get your Reaper. Um, but if you're playing something like Domination or pretty much any other objective game type, really, uh, I really recommend that you use um, the Reaper as your first kill streak, followed by the AC-130 and then the Osprey Gunner or Juggernaut or whatever because like here you see me pick up my Reaper and like it's not always going to get you your Osprey Gunner you sometimes can get that one or two off and if you're one or two off you're going to have to run in there and get your kills and there's a high probability you can die right so if you get your Reaper you get one or two off and then you got your AC-130 after that you're pretty much guaranteed your Reaper uh, your Osprey Gunner sorry and that's really what's going to get it for you and I know what you're thinking, it's like 9 kill streaks. how am I going to get that? If you're playing Domination, right, you capture the home flag, the B flag, then you only need 7 more kills. 7 kill streaks, that's not hard at all. If you're running Hardline, that's a 6 kill streak. You can get that in your sleep, right? So, yeah, I really recommend you use that, because it is really going to help. And also, I think getting high kill streaks, um, like the way you move around the map is really going to get that for you as well like you see people go for moabs and stuff with like really bad guns like mp9 only pm9 and the reason that they get them is not because they're just amazing with every single gun yeah they're pretty good players and they got uh, good gun skills but it's the way they maneuver around the map that really gets them those kills they're always flanking people killing people from the sides and they're very rarely getting in a head on gunfights so that's really going to help you get uh, high kill streaks um, also, I would say use a gun that you're really comfortable with, because um, you know you're just gonna feel good about uh, getting your kill streaks, and you stand more of a chance really because you know the way that gun works and you know when to back off and not. And a silencer is really gonna help you with that as well. So I really recommend you use that. Just keep off the radar. That way you're running out for your kills as opposed to them coming to you, which sometimes can be good, but the majority of the time you wanna run to them. Um, and a few tips for the Osprey Gunner. So I put on this mount, I put my care packages right in the middle, and the reason behind that was like directly in front of me and behind me were two main spawn points. Right, they were spawning in front of me, so I was able to pick them off easily. And when you use an Osprey Gunner, you drop five care packages. Right, so your teammates going to be sprinting forward, and they want to get to those as fast as possible. So. I put them in, I put my care packages like literally outside two spawn points, not in the spawn points, because if you put them in the spawn points, you're going to get a couple of kills to start with, but your teammates will be rushing into their spawn trying to get those care packages, and the next thing you know, the spawns will have switched, and you'll be getting no kills because you just won't be able to see them. And so you, what you want to do is place it right on the edge of the spawn point so that they're still spawning, you can keep picking them off, and your teammates can still get the care packages. Um, so that's what I recommend you do. Uh, also, for the Osprey Gunner, like, I didn't know this, I recently just found this out, and it's really useful. Uh, you can actually toggle thermal on and off, uh, throughout, um, whilst you're in the Osprey Gunner, and that's really useful, especially on a map like Bakara or something, where it's, like, quite bright and it's got that greenish tint to it, which really stops you seeing quite as well as you could. Um, 
yeah, so that's pretty much all the tips I have. And oh, I get hard scoped. Oh, that's so annoying. I was one off my Reaper. Could have been a, like at least a 40 plus kill TDM. Um, but yeah, no. Uh, so there's not much of the gameplay left. And my friend actually got his Reaper here. He was about to get his Osprey, but didn't quite get enough time. And she's nicking all my kills. Look at that. That's two assists. Um, yeah, so anyway, guys, thanks for listening. The final score was 34 and 3. And thanks for listening. Uh, subscribe. Uh, like, comment, rate, and thanks.